How's it going everybody? Trevor Randall's Outdoors Iowa here today. And today we're going to do a quick little video of another tool that I'm going to start using for my outdoor adventures, you guys, and that is a bicycle. A lot of the spots that I fish and hunt can be readily accessible by bike trails and, and similar areas or easier spots I can bike for longer distances. So I picked up this bike on Marketplace. Uh, it's just a regular 29 inch mountain bike basically. Nice Schwinn, but uh, some of the ideas I have for it uh, be for fishing wise, I can have a backpack on my back. I already installed a rod holder. And if it, this works out really good, I might get, they have a basket you can come off the back of your seat with and it connects down to the rear axle and makes it for a little bit more storage and stuff like that. So a little bit more mobile. Definitely a different way to be getting out and hitting different areas. The, a lot of our river stretches here in town have bike trails going down both sides of the river so I can be able to access a lot more. And then also hunting wise, I have a few areas that I'm prospecting where if I can get to where I can hunt around town, it might be a little bit easier on me rather than the hour drive down to the farm. So I could get out more weekdays. And I'm thinking about getting like a wagon, like a kid's wagon or something to pull off the back. And that way, cause it's about where I'm prospecting is about a two mile ride. And I can pull a deer out pretty easily on a wagon. That'd be pretty cool. So got a few different ideas. Uh, we'll see where it goes. But for right now, I'm going to try to keep it simple. We've got mushroom season coming up. Got a couple different lake areas that I could bike and try to hit different areas for crappie. And possibly even walleye. There's a lot of areas on the river where you're trying to walk long distances to get to these spots to fish. And a bike can definitely help that. You'll have to not mind the mess. I've got a chicken coop going up and a duck coop. Starting an urban homestead, you guys. Uh, so that's been taking up quite a bit of my time here the last couple weeks. So I'm trying to get done as soon as possible. The chickens are due to come out uh, to the coop here in about two weeks. So it would be pretty cool having her own eggs. And I got ducks to practice my calls with, you guys. Or row and ducks, they look just like mallards. So pretty cool. But anyway, so for the bike, like I said, just a 29 inch tire, bigger bike, bigger frame. Um, it's nothing too special. I might raise the handlebars a little bit. The handlebars sit pretty low, but for a rod holder right now, I just did a PV, piece of PVC, cut a slot in it so the reel fits down, and zip tied it to the frame of the bike. You have to be careful because if you get it too close, you're going to be hitting your feet on your pole. So that's where that basket that comes off the back of the seat and comes down. If I get that, they're like 20, 30 bucks on Amazon. If I'm able to get that, it might make the rod holders a little bit more accessible and easier to pedal. Other than that, I can get some lights on it in case I want to bike at night or in the dark. It'll be a good start though. I'm gonna to try to see if I can use it for mushroom season here, uh, which is coming up really quick, you guys. We're within like two weeks of mushroom season, I bet. I'm gonna start looking and I have a lot of areas that I can bike to for mushrooms and it'll get me a lot more access to certain areas too uh, if I'm not walking as far in between. So I'm excited about that. But I think I'm most excited about the hunting with it as well. I got turkey hunting areas that if I can possibly bike around, I could call turkeys and see if I could hear them from the public lane and then walk in on them from the bike trail. That'd be pretty interesting. So we're gonna see if this is gonna work for a nice tool to be used. Um, there is the option of electric bikes, but I don't know if I'm quite that close to getting one of those. Uh, it seems pretty interesting, pretty nice, but I want a bike that I'm not gonna care for as much because it's gonna go in the back of the truck. Uh, it's gonna sit in the back of the truck while I'm at work, stuff like that and running around town so i have to be able to come up with a way to lock it in my truck so you know it's not as easy to steal because people do do that unfortunately but for fishing hunting and mushroom hunting purposes you guys i think this thing is gonna make some pretty cool little videos you know it may not appear in the channel often but definitely going to be used definitely going to be a, a awesome tool to use and utilize uh, how many of you guys use bikes to get to your fishing areas and hunting areas? Like the hunting is the one that I'm pretty, I'm interested in. Like 
I'm going to try to use it for bow hunting, you guys. And I think with that kid's wagon, I could be able to put the bow and my gear in the wagon and get out to the area, lock the bike up. And there's some really cool areas I found. I'm I'm gonna put cameras out this year and I'm gonna see how many deer are around because there's not a lot of people that hunt that area and it's public ground. So that's what's pretty cool about it. So hopefully this is gonna work out this year and we're gonna start having some biking videos, you guys. And we'll get some exercise. Can't complain with some exercise. Uh, walking's great and all, but also getting out on the bike, seeing some scenery, stuff like that. It can be a pretty calming activity biking as well and you get to see all the scenery so it does make for a pretty nice little outing and enjoying the outdoors you guys that's what this is all about you gotta get out and enjoy the outdoors utilize what we can and adapt use what we want and make it work for us and i think that's what this bike is going to do for me but thank you for watching got a little bit of a mess still going around home i gotta pick up and everything like i said we're building that chicken coop duck coop Got a chicken run coming in. Got a lot to do, you guys. The weather's kind of put us on hold here for a little bit. Been in the 20s this week. It's been extremely cold and kind of crappy. A little bit of rain and sleet. Some of the parts of Iowa got snow this week, you guys. So, but I think it's going to start warming up here pretty soon and everything's just going to start taking off. I've got the kayak ready to go. I'm going to get the boat ready next. And we're going to have some fun this year, you guys. We're going to get out as much as possible with this new work schedule. But I hope you guys enjoyed the bike video. Let me know if there's any mounts or accessories that you guys use on your bikes that work better for you. And maybe I can look into them and see if I can add them to my bike. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'll catch you guys later. And she swallowed it. That is a